I V M. TFG Interviews is an IVM production, and you can also check out their other awesome shows like The Seen and the Unseen, hosted by Amit Verma, where he discusses topics related to economic policies and its impact on our society. You're listening to TFG Interviews. What's up, everyone? It's a new episode of the TFG Interview Podcast. I'm your host, Suju, and I have some great show lined up for you because uh, Chiranjeet, our football guy, has got an interesting conversation with uh, Alfred Jarian, the player for Azal FC, who has been an instrumental guy for their success. He's uh, back again with the team for the third season. Uh, now, as they kick off their uh, new season for I League, uh, Chiranjeet caught up with him. So let's hear what uh, what was the conversation and what he's expecting uh, from the new season. So, uh, I mean, you were one of the first and major signings once Aizal FC came into I, 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 sorry, I League, right? And uh, you you were going into uh, you know the new league with a new club, and you were at a new place. So, uh, you know, how how was the experience? Just sort of taking on this entirely new experience. You know, when the ASEAN approached me first and uh, to be part of the club and the and the management, the board, and they explain some things like they have a vision, they, they may not be a big club, yeah. but they have a big heart, you know. So, I thought, I thought it was myself, I think, first I need to go and see the city, look at the environment, then I can decide. And I came by, saw the environment, the city, and the people, they are more peaceful and loving. So, I, I got amused. So, I decided to be part of the team and to try to take on this journey and actually I did it and uh, it became fruitful for men and also for the entire club. Yeah, it became fruitful. So, uh, you know, the first first season and the team wasn't, you know, a lot of young players out there uh, and who had not played at this level. So, how how was your interaction with the youngsters in the team? Like, because as a senior player, you had to take on some some of a you know become something of a counselor for them to adjust to this level, right? Yeah, they, you know, like uh, when you playing as a professional footballer, even a mature player that have played for a long time in the game, and when you play with a young kids or uh, young players they have the energy the tendency that they want to play but uh, you have to at least pass in your knowledge uh, how to play how to be more patient be cautious and from there you they can grow gradually and the team can be more compact so i think when we started playing with them we the most and like experienced guys we pass on our knowledge even the coaching staff and, uh, uh, they started growing, but what we, we we thought is much better, and teams were going so far, and that's it is. But uh, you know, just just the league finished with Azal FC in the relegation spot, mm-hmm. right? And then you were playing in Federation Cup against uh, the champions, <coughs> basically, at that time. Uh, yeah. What was the thought going into that? Did you think you could flip the script on them? No, the, the, there was no big thought going in our head. We only thing that we. When we we fling the league, and yeah. because of the uh, uh, AIFA rules, and they cut us. Mm-hmm. Uh, when DSK cannot be relegated, yeah. we have to be. Yeah. They want to go, and uh, we we feel that it was a little bit unfair. You know, we the player because we look at our energy, everything. So when we came into the federation. Uh, everybody we say we have to go fund us. We just have that belief like we can go fund us. So when the the the, the selection came, like okay, ASEAN is going again, Bengaluru. So we was not panic. We we're like, oh, this is the best, best, this is the best time to play Bengaluru because for us we don't have nothing to lose. So we just have to play until AIF that we we deserve a spot in our league. So we went into Bengaluru game. Even Davy was there at that time. So we went to Bengaluru game. With no fear, we play with our our easy mind, then no tension. We won Bengaluru, who went away, so everybody was like, oh, what happened? But we was not, like, uh, under pressure or anything in the Federation Cup. But, but uh, Federation Cup, you went in 
as a survival battle like you you uh, yeah, you know, actually picked it yeah. to picked it to show that you no, you, you, you won the spot back in yeah. Yeah, Ali yeah. so that's why so we were playing the the federation as yeah. winning favor from the AIFF even to the playing um, body of Indian Football Association even some sport offers in India that they, they should help us in such a minor that yeah this team is a good team they had a feature let them remain early so it was only the message we were given to AIFF at that particular moment so you know next next season obviously you came in uh, as the team that got relegated but you know showed big heart in federation cup did you ever have any idea at the beginning that you could go all the way yeah you know <laughs> we first you know when there's a saying like uh, you if we are the bottom they don't mean that you are the last but how best you can be mentally strong and physical and try to calculate your step you can also be at the top so when we came to the new alley last season so we thought to ourselves that hey guy this is the last chance that EFF are giving us so we had to prove to them that we belong in the mix of the early the early teams so this year we shouldn't do what we did last season so we are like more focused last season like okay same we was we got ready to get there and because of some uh, talks uh, DSK couldn't get ready to get there so this is we have to give all up so we went into the league we won mine that every game is a final game every game is a final game and we were playing at that and we started having confidence in each game we started winning we started winning until we got ourselves in where we was as winning the championship but we didn't have a dream about just we want to win championship we don't have a dream about winning game by game things like so what was different about the second season uh, in the team's attitude than the first season? The second season uh, was quite a bit uh, much mature because the first season, uh, many of the young players it was their first season also, so it was kind of you know, hard, you know. But the second season, they were much confident that like Chiruba, Ratara, like uh, even the uh, uh, Damoya, the uh, MK, you know, William, all of them. It was their second season, you know. So. Even Brenda, uh, then their second season, so they were more confident in them that they can give up. So at that time, and the coach we have as well too, you know, we cannot forget about what he did for the club because he tried to put the teams together through his own set of mind, and uh, he created a group of loving and like unity. Even the Jaish, Ashuto, Abino, and even Amland. Uh, Kamu, all of them, uh, Kingsley. So everybody was like a brother. So we was fighting like a brother uh, every day, every day, every day. Every game we play, we fight like a brother. And we were playing with some questions because the coach was had been coaching the Ali for a very long time. Maybe he had some setback with Mumbai FC, but when he came, he also tried to. Proof Mumbai FC wrong that he's a better coach. So even uh, we as FC players, we wanted to prove EFL we also are better, a better team and also a better players. So we were like two teams, we we're going with, for one goal as to achieve one thing. So that's why everything worked out. So uh, just, just the la- you know, at at what point did you start realizing that we may become champions? Ah, uh, you know, we we started realizing. That we can become champion when we play uh, DSK away in DSK because when you go DSK to win, there is very hard. Yeah. So we went in DSK. Uh, we got three points because yeah. we no when we were going for the DSK. We we're like we don't have the uh, the focus that we want to be champion. All we want is to be in the best position in our league. That was our motive. So, but when we went DSK, we won DSK one goal in in a down million. So we said, oh, I think we can we can fight for this uh, first spot or maybe second. Yeah. But we always always say, oh, more Banga and East Bengal, they are always uh, the big one. I think they will go, you know. But after we won DSK, we said, I think we can fight with them. Yeah. But we won again in Maneva, we had a draw, you know. So we we came down again. So I think it's no way. But. Uh, 
Of course, no. You guys have to think. We when uh, he said, he said you have to think about becoming yeah, champions. Yeah, yeah. So you have to think of becoming uh, finishing the first or second. I want okay. first or second spot. Okay. So from there, we just had a mentality of training harder. That's it. We started approaching games. We won our games. Yeah, we was undefeated on the touch, on the top. And also, that's it. Yeah. So. You know, obviously we're going to talk about the match that happened right here, you know, <laughs> Aizol FC Mohan Bagan, mm. right? Going into that match, did, uh, you know, with, <laughs> with, with, you know, the entire town turning up, <laughs> was, was it, uh, was, were there some special words from uh, the coach or the management going into that? Because Play, everything like, can happen here. Yeah, going into the match again, Mohan Bagan, like, our coach, you know, to, to us at um we just had to be focused mentally and physically, but uh, we shouldn't panic. Yeah. We shouldn't put ourselves on a stress that we force to win. Mm-hmm. Even the president came and told us, hey, just relax and play. Don't play like because you, you want to be champion. We already know that you are champion for us. Yeah. In the whole of Asia, I should know that you are our champion. Even if you don't win early, you are our champion for us. So play with pride. Yeah. So we came into the game, we played with not under pressure because what the first thing my coach to her that in that game he said that uh, most often Mohabaga will be under pressure they want to draw but we want to win but play like freely like you, you are playing a normal game so Mohabaga was more cautious like they want the draw like very vital for them yeah. so they were like more uh, like you holding a goal or, or damn or you don't want to lose it so they were like keeping that uh, momentum into we got a knockout with them when Zotia yeah. scored the head up. Yeah. So all of them came down. No. But we was not like we want to win, but we want to play away with, with passion and more safety. Mm. Yeah. So so then again like the final game, you know, in Shillong. Yeah, yeah. And and yeah. that was one one tenth affair. It is so, kind, of game, <laughs> kind of crazy game. But <laughs> nobody could tell that we could carry because even Shillong yeah. Uh, arrival, Debbie Marge, a lot, yeah. lot of things were happening that day. She don't like, you cannot win Ali, the first Nordic thing to win Ali cannot happen in history, yeah. all type of thing. But when we fought battle in that game, I wasn't playing. Yeah. And even like, uh, Ashuto was not playing because we had, we picked a card again, more Bagan. Yeah. So we have four cards, so we couldn't play. So yeah. the game went uh, in the first half when Dika scored, I was on the bench. But I believe that. Uh, my mates were going to do their best. You know, after the first half... Did you, did you travel? Uh, because I wasn't there. I, I travelled. I travelled with the team. I was there on, on the field, but they didn't play. Me, I should too. But uh, we saw them. Yeah. We wanted to tell them, hey, guys, you can do it, man. Believe in yourself, man. You guys can do it. So the second half, they came. They yeah. went in. The game totally changed. We started doing well. So I yeah. think it was quite okay. And it's a historical and a remarkable days for yeah. everyone that was part of the team. Even the yeah. fans, the players, the officials. It was so re- re- remarkable. So, uh, I mean, were you keeping track of the other game during the match? <laughs> yeah, I was sitting. <laughs> when the Chana school first, yeah. I said, oh, Chana is leading. I said, I don't think Chana can win Mohabaga in yeah. Kokata. Not possible. Yeah. But I say it's football, they can win. But all of a sudden, they say Kasumi or who score? They say Kasumi or someone score. After that, I say, say 1 1. I say Mohabagan will win. So we was not focusing on Mohabagan game at all. We were focusing on our game. We said we, we should win or draw. That's our motive. Because we said that when you look at the the balance of Mohabagan and the balance on Chennai at that time, Chennai will concede any, any cause because the balance is not much. If like okay, if like maybe Mohabagan going against maybe the like DSK, uh, maybe that that Bengaluru will say okay, I think they will draw or something. But, uh, the balance was not there, so we were focusing on only our game. Yeah, yeah that's why. So uh, when you were celebrating after after winning, is there is there one uh, incident that something that happened that that really stays in your mind while celebrating or, or directly after winning? You know? uh, after winning, we were we were all the wars. We got like a dream. Uh, yeah. We even that day, I don't even know if we won our league. Yeah, I slept. We were just laughing. Oh, our league, our league! But uh, <laughs> we don't know if we even win the our league. You know, yeah. you know. Except the next day, we were traveling back. Yeah. That's the time we started thinking. Oh, so we already won the our league. Yeah, because we were like, as we see, we our league. Yeah. We in you know, it like a dream for us. We the player like. 
So we saw him, but why we we did all this while? So we won yeah. early yesterday. Yeah. Uh, we were seeing the trophy in the, in the car, like ah, we won the league. We are going high school now. Yeah. Uh, they, but the day we won the league, yeah. they were totally crazy. Nobody could believe. It. Everybody was just walking like to say they are living in a dreamland. You know? <laughs> it was so funny. So, so uh, you know, coming back, you had that grand celebration and everything, uh, and uh, obviously, uh, you know. Just now you're going into the next season as the champions. Yeah. Is it is it different now? Does it feel different? Yeah, yeah, it's totally different because the, we are getting a mix of players and also some new young boys is here. And the old players that were here, most of them they got some offer, big offer for Mohabagan, East Bengal, and even ISL. But uh, it's also a challenge. The state you can see a lot of quality players. Mm. I think uh, there's still hope for Mizoram football, also for us, we So, I think in the second league, the coming season, we can we can put out a surprise. But we have to go on again with a new challenge. It's not going to be easy, but we have to go on a new challenge. Okay, and you have played for many clubs over your career. Yeah. Can you now say Isol FC is the most special? Yeah, it's the most special. Uh, sorry to say, but it's the most uh, first club in my whole career now because I have achieved everything. Yeah. Being the best foreign player in India, winning the best midfielder in India, and winning a uh, I league. I think for me, uh, they are the best. They are the best. Yeah, they are the best. So, me. so how about Asia? Looking yeah. forward to? Yeah, we were hoping for Asia, but it's a new challenge in yeah, playing in Asia. Because Asia is that we are new, you know? yeah. we don't have much experience, mm. but uh, we have to go with mm. we one set mind and we have to go with what, who, who, who has experience, who have played like foreigners, mm. can help the other young guys, and we can at least uh, put out a surprise, even yeah. because we will be playing not just for ASFC, but for the entire nation, yeah. India, because we are representing India in the AFC, not just... As the FC, so we have to play with mm. some passion that we are the champion yeah. and this the league champion. Yeah. So we have to show the people in, in, uh, around the world that uh, yeah. Indian league is more active. They have a good club. They have a good teams. Mm. This is another new team, and they are also a good um, uh, players playing for yeah. them. So does it feel like the first season in I League in Asia, <laughs> like when you came into I League for the first time, yeah, and, and now you're going into the Asia for the first time? Yeah, it's feel, it feel somehow uh, difficult, but then uh, it's football. Yeah, we just have to give our best shot. Yeah, yeah. That was a great conversation there. It's always uh, really good to see uh, players talk their heart out about the teams that they play for or the season that they're looking forward to. Uh, once again, as well, looks like an interesting squad. We'll have to wait and watch how uh, they perform for this new season with the new coach and new assistant coach and fairly new team. Uh, so let's see how that goes about. And if you did like the show, then please to the please show us that you did like, share, subscribe to our YouTube channel, hit the bell icon so, get, uh, so you don't miss out on any, any such episodes of our daily show or the interview podcast. Uh, let us know your thoughts below in the comment section, especially if you're an Isol FC player. Uh, you can talk to us directly. You can ask if you want. You can ask Sharanjit more about how is he like to talk to and everything. He's on Twitter, Sharanjit Oja. I'm on Twitter, Sajjum Matthew94. Uh, have a great day, folks. Enjoy. Cheers. Come back to us. Bye bye. See you. Excuse me, Bhaiya. Excuse me. Bolle, madam. Menu me kya hai? Menu me seen and seen hai. Podcast hai, on course hai, Cyrus hai, Mer in India, Rediscovery Project, Empowering Series, Sex Vex hai, IVM Likes hai, Simplified hai, Keeping It Queer hai, Things and Destinations hai, My Neighbor Zuckerberg hai, or The Fan Garage hai. Aapko kya chahiye hai? Uh, ek baar repeat kar denge kya? Repeat, repeat nahi karta hum. Aap jao, IVMPodcast.com pe aur suno ye sab. Ya fir download karo unka app. Sab aapke ungliyo pe.